In this video, I am going to share you 5 tips to maintain your electric vehicle safe in this summer season. So before diving into the video, this is Aditya and you are watching Electric Vehicles India. Friends, we are in the April right now and the temperature now has crossed 40 degrees in most of the areas in our India. So basically, we saw fire in the electric vehicles in 2022 summer. So two years back, companies like Ola and Pure EV electric scooter has blasted and many customers got panicked with this situation. So in the 2022 and 2023, electric vehicles industry has came down. But after completion of 2023 summer, as none of the electric vehicles has blasted that year, many customers trusted the electric vehicles and till now, many customers are buying electric vehicles but this summer is different from past two years because in april itself we are experiencing 40 degrees of heat so all the ev owners must and should follow some of the tips to maintain your electric vehicle safe in this summer season so now i'm going to share you five tips to maintain your electric vehicle safe in this summer the first tip is don't overcharge or don't over discharge. The present lithium ion batteries loves to stay in temperature between 25 to 35 degrees. If the temperature came down or if the temperature got up, the lithium ion batteries tend to heat and tend to blast. So to maintain your electric vehicle battery safe, you shouldn't overcharge or you shouldn't over discharge. The current lithium ion cells will be arranged parallelly to make it a complete battery pack. So if one cell in a lithium ion battery gets damaged, all the cells will be get damaged and it will explode so to avoid this you should maintain the temperature of your electric vehicles battery in between 25 to 35 degrees celsius it will be okay if it reaches 40 degrees celsius also but it shouldn't cross the 40 degrees celsius so to maintain this you shouldn't overcharge your electric vehicle battery so when you are charging your electric vehicle battery try to cut off your charge when it reaches 90 to 95 percent of the charge and when you are discharging your electric vehicle battery try to stop it at 15 to 20 percent don't charge above 95 percent and don't charge below 15 percent to make it safe in this summer season and many of you will charge the electric vehicle at the night time and you leave the charge entire the night try to charge your electric vehicle by waking up at 6 a.m then you will charge your electric vehicle till 10 a.m so don't charge your electric vehicle overnight even though if your electric vehicle charger has auto cutoff feature please try to avoid charging your electric vehicle overnight and please try to limit fast charging sessions in this summer because when you charge charge your electric vehicle with the help of a fast charging station it will put continuously pressure on the lithium ion cells so in that situation lithium ion battery cells can be exploited so try to limit your fast charging sessions in this summer season Second tip is choose right charging socket. Many of you will charge your electric vehicle at the charging socket where we charge our mobile phones. Don't charge your electric vehicle battery at 5 ohms or 6 amp socket. Try to charge your electric vehicle battery at 15 or 16 amp socket. If you have the MCB switch at that socket, it's more safe because electric vehicles use high current when you're charging it. The 5 amps or 6 amp sockets in our home don't support this EV battery charging. So try to charge your electric vehicle battery at 15 15 amps or 16 amp socket only and try to avoid charging your electric vehicle by using extension many of you will use the extension boxes which you purchased in the amazon or flipkart if you are using an extension box make sure it has 15 amps or 16 amp socket along with a 15 amps switch Third tip is rest your electric vehicle. If you are planning a long ride on your electric vehicle, so my suggestion is not to plan a long ride on your electric vehicle in this summer season. But if you want to do so, please rest your electric vehicle for every 10 to 15 minutes. Because if you are riding your electric vehicle continuously, the BMS will keep continuously extracting the power from the EV battery and it will continuously keep powering the motor to keep your electric vehicle running. So if you are running your electric vehicle continuously to 20 to 25 kilometers, the battery and the motor will get heated so to avoid this rest your electric vehicle for every 10 to 15 minutes so that the battery and the motor will get cooled down Fourth tip is don't immediately charge. Don't immediately charge your electric vehicle after completion of your trip. Please try to give 10 to 15 minutes of gap between your ride and charging. So you shouldn't charge your electric vehicle immediately after completion of your ride. Many of you will do that. Please avoid that in this summer season. And don't try to take your electric vehicle out immediately after completion of the charger. Please try to give 10 to 15 minutes of gap because when you are charging the electric vehicle, the lithium ion batteries will get heated up. So to make them cool, you should minimum maintain a gap of 
of 10 to 15 minutes after completion of the charge and while taking your electric vehicle out and many of you will charge your electric vehicle the portable battery packs of your electric vehicle inside home please try to avoid that in this summer season if you want to charge your electric vehicle battery in your home please make sure no one is present in that room so you should charge your electric vehicle in an empty room but most of the times try to keep the electric vehicle charging outside your home whether it might be in the balcony or it might be in your parking place but don't try to charge your electric vehicle battery inside the room especially when there is ac in that room last tip is don't over accelerate current electric cars have active cooling system in them so when the electric vehicle battery heats up in electric cars a coolant will flow in between them and that will make the ev battery cool but when it comes to electric two wheelers no active cooling system available in any of the two wheelers which are in the current market only companies are using passive cooling system which won't make much effect to the battery so when you continuously accelerate your ev the current draws from the electric vehicle battery continuously then there is a chance to get the ev battery get heated fast so to avoid this please try to accelerate your electric vehicle smoothly don't accelerate fast or don't make sudden acceleration so if you want to maintain your electric vehicle battery life long please try to give a linear acceleration when you are riding it so if you can follow these five tips your electric vehicle will be safe in this summer season please try to share this video to your ev friends or your ev groups so that they can also follow these five tips to make their electric vehicle safe in this summer season so if you found the video informative please hit the like button and watch your opinion on this video please let me know in the comments see you in next video until then go green go electric